How's it going? <laughs> Hi, babe. What's your name and where are you from? Uh, my name's Gavin. I'm from Gippsland, Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> Taking it all in, Gavin? Yeah, this is bigger than my town at home. This is sick. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do for a living, Gavin? I am a telemarketer at a call center. Living the dream. <laughs> living the dream. <laughs> what are you doing for us tonight? I'm going to tell some comedy, t do some gags. <laughs> <laughs> Why AGT? Uh, I chose to do this because I actually <laughs> dropped out of law school to do comedy, so I really want to prove Dad wrong, to be honest. <laughs> 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 so, do you have anyone with you tonight? Yeah, I've got my, <laughs> my disapproving father and... Uh... <laughs> well, let's try to prove him wrong. <laughs> have, fun out, right. have fun out there. No heart. Sick. Uh, I, I, am, I am from Gippsland, guys. I, uh, I'm a Gibby boy. <laughs> right? Uh, good stuff. <laughs> uh, but my town was recently affected by the bushfires. Uh, a couple months ago, which was not good. And uh, we got like the notification from the CFA. They're like, you need to evacuate. You need to get out of here. But for some reason, my dad's a hero. He's like, I'm not going anywhere. We're going to fight this fire. <laughs> get the hoses, Gavin. Get the pumps. When this fire comes over the hill, we're going to take it on. And I was like, Dad, we're renting. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is a commission house. Let the government fight the fire, you buffoon. What are you doing? <laughs> uh, the thing about me is uh, I used to work in uh, fast food for six years. <laughs> I'm a real hero. I, uh... <laughs> but the thing about out in the country, right, it's fairly racist, unfortunately. And I had this one racist customer come up to me. He's like, hey, man, can I get a ham and cheese toasty? It's like, yeah, man, $2.50, it's all yours. He's like, is that ham on the toasty halal ham? Is that halal certified ham on the toasty? Because I only want true Australian ham on my toasties. He's like, I only want Australian ham between my bread. I was like, mate, to be fair, I don't even think it's ham. <laughs> Because I live in the country, I'm always catching the V-line into the city, which is sick. Uh, I had this guy come up to me, right, which is always what you want on a public transport. And uh, he comes up, he's like, hey, man, just want to let you know that you look like a famous person. He's like, sick, comedy's going well. But he's, he's like, nah, I just want to let you know that you look like Kira Knightley. <laughs> if she had a mustache. <laughs> Another thing I've been told is, uh, I've been told it looked like Captain America before he's injected with the super serum. <laughs> <laughs> the best one is, I've been told it looked like Nicolas Cage if he had an ice addiction, so... <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you got me, Grandad, you cheeky bugger. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> You are my Captain Australia, is what you are. Gavin, <laughs> yeah, you had me at a Facito t-shirt with a sausage sizzle on there. Everyone loves a bunny snack. Yeah. <laughs> I dropped out of law school also to become a performer. Sick. Represent. So I have like a kind of vested interest in you. <laughs> Your parents are actually backstage as well. I don't think you know. <laughs> We got him in. We did it. Mate, I'm from Melbourne, and that makes both of us from Victoria. I'm so glad we can prove that the, some of the great comedy comes out of this state, and it's so great it comes out of Gippsland. Thanks, man. <laughs> Do you mind bringing your dad up? Yeah, get out of here, Dad. <laughs> get out of here, Dad. Yay! Give it up for him. <laughs> What's your name, Dad? Gavin's dad. Yeah, OK. <laughs> he's, he's a comedian, too. Did you laugh when your son said to you that he was dropping uh, law school? Was it funny for you? No. <laughs> <laughs> Do you understand why he's done it now? No. 